Hello, this is Daniel, please. My name is Daniel and welcome to yet another Minecraft video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Forge Mod Loader for Minecraft 1.13.2, which is the latest version available as of recording this video. But before we get started, I now have a Discord server and a Reddit page, so if you want to talk to me personally or share your ideas for videos with me or the community, be sure to head down into the description for the links to both my Discord server and my subreddit. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So first, we need to go to the Forge Mod Loader website. You can either look up Forge on Google or go down into the description where I've put a direct link to this website, so you know, you don't have to look it up yourself. So it's by default still set to Minecraft 1.12.2 and that is probably because there is no recommended release for 1.13 yet, which means you are going to be installing a version that is not stable or at least not completely finished and recommended. So what you wanna do once you get onto this website, if it's still on 1.12.2, you need to go into this menu on the left here and click 1.13, then click 1.13.2. And this will redirect you to the download page for Minecraft Forge 1.13.2. Now, there's a couple of options we have here. This is the box that we need. This is the version. I hope that by the time you're downloading Forge, there is an actual recommended release and it will probably be to the right here. But the steps will be the exact same. So what you want to do, and this is the easiest way to install Forge, is just click Installer. Now this will redirect you to a page that is likely going to contain an ad, but that doesn't really matter. Just don't click the ad and wait for this thing up in the upper right corner here to count down to zero until a skip button appears. Then all you've got to do is click skip. And as you can see, Forge is just being downloaded. And just let it finish. It will always ask you if you are sure you want to keep this file. That's because it's a .jar file. If it gives you this notification, this almost looks like a warning, but it's really not a harmful file. Just click keep and the download will be finished. All we've got to do now is click the file you just downloaded and it will appear here. But before you install Forge, you first need to have played the Minecraft version that you're trying to install Forge for at least once. It's very likely that you have already played Minecraft 1.13.2 once, but if you haven't, just open up the Minecraft launcher, click the play button, set to the latest release, and make sure to just let it start up once up until the menu. From there, you can just quit the game and you'll be able to install Forge. And afterwards, you can open this installer again or just leave it open in the background. That's not really important. And click install client. If you want to make a server with mods, you need to click install server, of course. So I'm going to select install client and hit OK. It takes some time, but we have now successfully installed Forge for Minecraft 1.13.2. You can just click OK, and now once we start up Minecraft, we will have the option to select a different profile using this drop up menu. So as you can see, this little drop up menu shows you that you have successfully installed Forge for Minecraft 1.13.2. Now if you want to add mods to Forge, I will make a more elaborate tutorial on that if you guys really need that. But all you actually need to do is select Forge, just click it, and the play button will change to Forge. Just play it once, just click play, let it load, and close it again. And if you want to add mods afterwards, all you've got to do is go into the search bar, hit percent app data percent, click enter, and go to dot Minecraft, and there will be a mods folder here. And you can literally drop all of your mods in this mods folder, which is not here yet because I haven't played Minecraft yet. But if I were to click play right here, you will see that a mods folder will be generated. There we go. There it is. And to prove my point, now that the game has successfully started up, I can show you that we are indeed playing Forge Beta. It's not a recommended release. Probably by the time you're watching this anytime in the near future, there will be a full release where it won't give you this 
warning but down here in the uh, bottom left corner we can see that forge 25.0.70 is installed for minecraft 1.13.2 so that's important we've got a mods menu here that shows you all the mods that you have installed which is zero for me right now but if you want me to show you guys how to install mods any specific mods and if you guys actually seem to run into problems with installing mods then be sure to let me know and i will look into it and maybe even create one of these videos again so i hope you enjoyed this video if you actually did and if this actually helped you to install forge then be sure to leave that thumbs up let me know down below in the comments what worked and what didn't work if you have any questions leave them down below in the comments and i'll try to answer them but i've also had the experience that other really kind people just will help you out down below in the comments hope you enjoyed and i will of course catch you in the next video see ya